If you're looking to take your career to the next level and stand out in a competitive job market, then an MBA degree with a business analytics specialization might be just what you need. According to the GMAC, a recruiter survey from 2018 showed that 71% of responding employers plan to place recent business school graduates into data analytics roles. And I'd imagine that percentage is higher these days. So not only will you be more competitive and there's demand out there in the job market for it, but you can also look forward to a nice potential starting salary of over six figures. So in this video, I'm gonna explain why this path might make sense for you and why employers find this so valuable. So before I even get started, if you're new to the channel, my name is Richard Walls and I'm here to help you with career development and personal finance. If either of those two topics are of interest to you, do make sure to subscribe down below, hit the notification bell so you get notified when I post new videos. So with that said, let's get started. So why is business analytics so important? When it comes to making the best possible business decisions and the company has limited resources, which, Every company has limited resources, they have limited people, limited money, limited time. They need to get the most value out of the resources that they have. And this involves analyzing data and gathering insights to make an informed decision. And ultimately what you're trying to do with this data is you're trying to look at that, identify certain patterns, and really, you're gonna make a prediction about what's gonna happen in the future if you take this action versus this other action. This is known as prescriptive analytics. You're prescribing an action based on this data. And this type of analytics removes a good amount of the uncertainty for the person making the decision. And business analytics can be used in a variety of different ways in a variety of different functions at a company. It can help organizations identify areas of improvement, such as customer service, marketing, the product itself. If you look at the data, for example, and you have a thousand customer reviews and 900 of those reviews say something about, oh, well, this product doesn't have this feature. Now this data is very important because you've identified a trend and now you have some guidance as to what to do about your product going forward. And that's really what it's all about. It's about identifying trends and opportunities so that you can capitalize them, make better decisions, and stay ahead of competition, and give the customers a good value, give the customers what they want, thereby increasing chances of the company's success. Now, why should you get an MBA with a business analytics specialization? The reason is, you'd be like the superhero of the organization. I'm sure you can buy a cape on Amazon and really get into that, really get into that whole theme. But historically, if you look at MBA curriculum, it generally focuses on marketing, basic accounting, basic finance, strategy, leadership, organizations. And it's only been in recent years that data analytics or business analytics has played a much larger role and how curriculum is being developed. And if you have a specialization in analytics, that's going to stand out. That's gonna give you an edge because analytics can be applicable to, like I mentioned earlier, just about any business function at a company. And because you speak the language of business, but also tech, and tech in terms of data, if you imagine if you're a younger professional entering a company for the first time, you likely won't have a lot of credibility built up. So when it comes time for you to make a suggestion or offer an idea, if you don't have the credibility yet, the one way to overcome that, and this is something I've used to great effect in my career because I've always been the youngest person in most of the roles that I've been in, the one thing I could use that elevates my credibility is data. It's quite hard to argue with an idea that's supported by good data that effectively replaces whatever credibility you would eventually get in your career, but it gives you a greater degree of confidence because you do have this data to support you, you feel more confident in the decisions that you're recommending and making. And as I mentioned at the beginning of this video, more companies are looking to hire business graduates with this skill set. So not only will the job be in high demand, you're also going to command a pretty healthy salary and the long-term prospects 
are quite great. So let's talk about that. What are the long-term prospects for someone with a business analytics specialization from an MBA program? Now, not only can you scale your career upwards with this degree and with the specialization, one of the biggest advantages in having analytics as a skill set is the versatility. It's used in virtually every industry from healthcare to retail, e-commerce, tech, you name it, data is there. This means you can tailor your career to your specific interests and passions, which of course may evolve over time, but you will have the flexibility to move between different industries as your career progresses. And in a similar vein, you'll be able to migrate across different business functions within the same company. But wherever you end up, as you gain more experience and get more years under your belt, you're going to be more qualified for more senior level positions like manager or director of analytics. And you may also eventually narrow your focus into one specific field of analytics like marketing analytics or finance or supply chain. Now, if you wanna dip your toes in the water of business analytics, you wanna check out this next video where I suggest some online courses to help you get up to speed on what it's all about, see if you want to pursue a degree in the first place, and to get an even more comprehensive view of data analytics Analytics, make sure to check out this video that I did where I earned my Google Data Analytics Certificate in about a month's time. I talk about my experience and my full review here. So with that said, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you around.